we will talk about facial skin aging and if we say what affects most our skin aging process first is of course our biological age second and very important is sun exposure and sun radiation and third is smoking of course other factors are also important but most important is sun radiation and smoking uh, skin aging is gradual process first fine lines occur around eyes around lips then wrinkles occur and sagging skin also sagging skin means skin loses elasticity and loses hydration and uh, we have sa such sagging skin uh, now let's say about problem itself we have intrinsic factors and, and extrinsic factors which causes skin aging intrinsic is genetic we can't do anything because many you know, factors are predefined it's genetical so we we can't touch genetic at this stage so um, no worries it's better to don't think about genetic you have what you have you should accept and we can take care about extrinsic factors and among extrinsic factors UV radiation or sun exposure is most important why it's important because sun rays directly damage our DNA they causing mutation in our DNA and this mutation increase risk of cancers also especially melanoma melanoma is skin cancer and UV radiation or sun exposure increases risk of melanoma another mechanism how um, sun affects our skin is damaged, co damaged collagen collagen is protein in our body and this protein makes our skin more elastic and when collagen is damaged skin loses elasticity and wrinkles occur and another mechanism how sun affects our skin is accumulation of free radicals in the cell and it causes cell damage or, uh, eventually and cell death and it causes also aging of skin now what we can do to avoid um, UV radiation and UV radiation skin damage and skin aging first is avoid direct sun exposure it's best method best prevention but if you can't try to avoid um, avoid uh, go out uh, during direct sunlight um, especially from 10 p uh, 10 a.m to uh, 4 or 5 p.m it depends uh, at this time um, uv radiation is strongest so avoid this period of time second is uh, sunscreen especially more than SPF 30 because you need a strong sunscreen to avoid this harmful effect of sun and avoid tanning beds tanning beds also directly damage skin because it also affects skin causing um, accumulation of free radicals causing damaged collagen so you should avoid uh, tanning beds it's very important also um, you know that uh, it's very difficult today to distinguish quality products non-quality products and uh, supplements and the uh, skin uh, care industry is overwhelming so I will tell you home remedies and supplements which are uh, strongly scientifically evidenced and first is first and simplest is green tea extract not for drinking but for cleaning your face every night before sleep you can clean your face 
with green tea extract and, and it improves uh, uh, it moistures your skin it, it's one also it contains um, antioxidants and these antioxidants uh, means protect your skin cells from destruction and it has uh, studies and meta-analysis that regular uh, regular intake of um, green tea extract intake as a oral supplements or intake as a topical applications uh, causes reducing wrinkles importantly uh, when we say importantly means more than 15 percent so green tea uh, extract really has evidences second important is honey honey is very simple you should apply it on skin also and it also contains uh, antioxidants and minerals and uh, it improves hydration of skin and elasticity of skin protects skin so it is also effective and it also reduces wrinkles around 20 percent and a more simple form you, you can use is green tea powder plus one tablespoon of honey and one tablespoon of yogurt uh, and apply as a face mask on your face uh, and leave around 15 to 20 minutes it's very easy simplest but effective skin mask uh, now let's say about supplements among supplements most evidenced is collagen collagen reduces wrinkles also 20 percent collagen as a oral supplements you should drink oral supplements it's effective because uh, collagen is protein as we said and it's important part of uh, important component of skin elasticity because collagen gives skin elasticity uh, and among topical supplements um, gold standard is retinoids especially tretinoin uh, these retinoids are uh, vitamin a derivatives forms of vitamin a and especially tretinoin for example is pre uh, prescription topical cream in many cases or lotion uh, or uh, other forms it, it it is used topically and it's very effective it's considered very effective reduces wrinkles around 36 percent also vitamin c and uh, hyaluronic acid are very popular uh, vitamin c uh, stimulates collagen production that's why it's important and uh, hyaluronic acid increases skin hydration why it increases because it's polysaccharide and it can bind more uh, around uh, thousand times more water than its mass so when you have hyaluronic acid you have more water in the skin and skin is hydrated and when it's hydrated you have less wrinkles so it's effective also of course healthy diet is important fruits and vegetables and whole grains is uh, because they are uh, full of vitamins minerals and help also skin hydration so you should pay attention healthy diet also now let's summarize to summarize most evidence supplement is collagen if you want to take one supplement it will be collagen for me it will be uh, collagen uh, for topical creams i think vitamin c is very good and tretinoin is best if you want home remedies best home remedy for me is green tea powder one uh, tablespoon of honey and one, one tablespoon of yogurt applied on your skin for 15 to 20 minutes that's all i wanted to say thank you for your interest thank you for your watching if you like my videos please thumbs up if you like my channel please subscribe thank you very much bye for now